Hello and welcome to a new Let's Play Poorly series, Supreme Ruler 2030. This is the released version. Uh, I may not do this at the at the regular pace that I play the other games, but I am going to be experimenting with kind of figuring out how to make my uh, playthroughs a little bit more uh, engaging, I guess. Uh, a lot less downtime. I've typically just played through and let the long, dull parts just keep on being in the recording. Um, and that's not really great. So I'm going to be trying to practice on this and this playthrough to do better. And uh, it's a really way to, good way to do that because there's a lot of downtime in a lot of this. So I'm going to go ahead and play as I usually do with Peru. Single player, sandbox. We're going to start in 2023. And my goal is to not die, I think. I think that's my goal, right? Uh, because I tend to I tend to get attacked by my uh, my neighbors uh, down the road. So what do I want? I want to show diplomatic relations. Yeah, everybody. We're kind of okay with these guys down here with Chile and uh, Argentina. I think. Yeah. Everybody else kind of neutral-ish. What do I want? I want that for a minute, just to get a lay of the land. All right. So let's get started. First thing we're going to do is set up... Oh, that's not what I want. We have to set up our... Um, our governor guys, our... Uh, ministers. So, let's see. Cabinet priorities for the state. We're going to uh, do trade relations and acquire technologies, I think. Oh, and then suddenly we get some diplomatic offers. They want some money. We've got five billion. Yeah, let's accept you. Oh, and they want to get that. Yeah, let's take that. China? Um, sure. Oh, I don't need this. And we'll accept. We're just going to accept these early ones everywhere. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. And this guy. Latvia. Yeah. Saudi Arabia. We're going to change our minds down the road, I'm pretty sure. So we have you set up. Finance guy. We want... Let me pause, actually, here. Uh, we probably need to... Hmm. Do we want to increase revenue? I think that's probably a goal. And improve our domestic approval rating. And we'll go with that. This guy. Oh, I was planning to... Was I going to just kind of... No, I'm not going to do that manually. That's that's insanity. Um, what do we want? We want import and export. And we want to maximize profit opportunities. And we want to sell the excess raw materials. Okay. And we're we're getting there. We're getting there, research guy. Okay, what are you researching? IOF2. Okay. And commercial internet. That's that's decent. Now for you, we'll give you. Um, I think what I'm gonna have you focus on whenever you do it automated is improving research efficiency. And um Basic technologies mm, or pure science, pure science. Okay, I'll probably manually do some of this myself, uh, a fair amount of it actually. Okay, so let's see. Tech, medical. I think medicals. Let's. Brachytherapy. 
electrocardiograph. I'm not playing this to optimize. I'm just going to I'm going to play how it how the vibe is, right? Ooh, digital movie production. I mean, sure. Let's do that. Let's add that. It's not going to it's not going to go right now because oh, I don't need you. I don't want to make you stop. Uh, there we go. All these diplomatic offers. Okay. Ukraine. Oh yeah, Ukraine. We're gonna auto accept all the UK Ukraines. We're gonna auto accept South Korea, Syria. Let's take that. Singapore. Let's take that. All right. Now let's get over here and see what we need. So agriculture. We're producing and using more than we're producing. So we need. Uh, we definitely need to do some of that. So let's go ahead and... Oh, where, where can... Well, you can actually build some stuff. All right, you, you, you have some spots available. Let's do that. And then over in rubber, we don't have the ability to do rubber at the moment, I don't think. Oh, I do. What am I, what am I building there, actually? A rubber plantation, fair enough. Okay, uh, it's a little obvious. Um... Timber mill. Ooh, the, uh, these guys. Yes. Auto accept all of those. Let's auto accept Sweden. United Kingdom. Excellent. Okay, so timber. We're doing great on timber. We don't need any more timber production. Bulk sales. We are set to bulk sales. Okay. Petroleum. Oh, yeah, we're going to need some petroleum. We need gas field. Let's go build a gas field there. We, we're not too far under. Let me see. Oh, and that's the only one we can make. Um, yeah, all right. And then coal production. Oh, yeah, we need more coal production as well. But there's nowhere to build just yet. Okay, who are you? Mexico? Oh, yeah, we like the Mexicans. Yes, we're going to auto accept on the Mexicans. And whatever it was, I just accidentally clicked. Who is this guy? Gambia. All right, fine. All right, Gambians, you, you're you're in our good graces for some reason. Coal mines. Uh, let's build a coal mine. Uh, where do I want it? I want it away from my borders. Honestly, let's build you right there. Build two. Metal ore production is great. Electric power is okay for right now, but that is going to change. Consumer goods. Ah, that's see that. That's why. I'm I'm spending a ridiculous amount of money here and and uh, and a ridiculous amount of supplies. But that's that's what we're gonna do. And then I'm gonna let it run for a bit. I'm gonna accept some. Uh, uh, some exchanges if I need to. We'll see how it goes. I just noticed this. Uh, of course, we're in 2023, so there's a lot of shit going on over here in... Uh, Ukraine. There's a lot of messages over here coming in on the map. Russian village has been captured by Ukraine. Ukraine village has been captured by Russia. They're just kind of going back and forth over here. It's kind of interesting to watch. Boom, 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 boom. They're just kind of cycling in and out. Hungry, yeah. Anyway, we don't need to... We, that's that, that's the other side of the world. We're, we're not super worried about them right now. Hide show... How do I make... Okay, that's that's a very subtle color. All right, so we're very close on getting our agricultural uh, buildings done, our new agricultural sections, and then the rubber is coming along. The gas field is next. Uh, what do we got here? Hungary, let's go. Ooh, and who are you guys? Oh, God, they're all over the place. Germany, let's auto accept Germany. Denmark, Norway, yeah. Coal is at 60%. We're getting there. Ooh. There it is. There's the agriculture, and we are now over what we need. Excellent. Malaysia. Go ahead. 
Rubber's just about ready to go. Come on, rubber. Time to pop. Boom. All right. And we're producing 113. Actually use... Okay. Yeah, excellent. Uh, we may... Oh, let's go ahead and auto-accept you. Auto-accept you guys. We might actually want a little bit more, maybe? Let's build one more. The consumer goods thing and the industry goods thing is going to be uh, major because we're using so much of that right now to build these things. Why is Germany not auto accepting? Hmm. We still at ninety percent on the industrial goods. We we should do one more. I think sixteen or seventeen hundred. Yeah, we'll probably need to do one more. Okay, Germany, you're starting to piss me off now. Auto accept, Germany. Everybody else seems to be playing ball. Ninety nine percent. Done. Okay. Yeah, we're only about a third of the way there. Not even a third. Or about a third. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we need more. We need more. We need more. Let's build three more. All right, so for some reason, the Romanians have been spying on us. I don't know what that's about. Um, what, what What's their problem? China. No, we're rejecting everything from China. We don't like China. Maybe I should be doing something with my spies. Where the heck are my spies? Who are my spies? These guys? Yeah. Espionage. Um, all right, let's look again at diplomatic relations. Oh, why are they getting worse? Ecuador. Oh, you bastards. Okay, well, yeah, let's um, let's do something there. Let's do recon. Do we want to do it in their capital? Sign there. Okay, and then Guy Kiel. And whatever the heck that is. Venka. Libertad. Rio Bamba. Mbato. Puyo. We're just gonna we're just gonna go everywhere with all of our guys here. Um, and then maybe a little bit of Brazil, because Brazil last time, um, was bad. Brasilia, Annapolis, Tina, I don't know. I don't know what any of these places, I mean, I, I know what they are, but like, I don't know if they're important. Um, Rio de Janeiro, there we go. No, oh, I didn't actually. I guess it probably didn't didn't all work. All right, that's fine. Come on, Germany, get with the program. All right, we can see now definitely our electric power issue. We're gonna need to deal with that. We can build some more, but these are all small ones. Let me see if I can do better. Maybe with a hydropower. I can afford it. I've got 11 billion. And that'll do 2174. This one does 1,000. The other small one is... Um, only does 544. Yeah, that's terrible. Uh, ooh, can we do any ocean power? I don't think so. No. All right, let's go. Maybe we can do a hydro. Build another hydro here. Is that where it's letting me do? That's an odd spot for that. Why? Why is it letting me do? Okay. Well, we'll do it there. We'll build a hydro there and we'll build two hydros there. All right.
right, so we've got commercial internet now. Excellent. And now we are working on this new infantry. Uh, so digital movie production is going to come up in a second. Let me see what else I want to do to queue up after that one. This is for uh, mostly, yeah, transportation for military things. Um, do we want to try to become a scientific powerhouse? I don't know. Oh, come on, Germany. Stop it. I hate you, Germany. What do we want to do? Uh, medical... Well, we should probably do some society stuff. Help us out a little bit. Are, are we actually okay? Literacy rate is 80%. That's decent for Latin America. Domestic approval rating is actual shit, though, so... Okay, Germany, come on now. Yeah, we got to do some social social stuff. Um, let's see. Digital social services. And... Yeah, let's do some digital social services, because I think education will help. Yeah, ministers recommending commercial holograms. Whatever for. That's weird. Okay. Okay, so our diplomatic relations with Ecuador are definitely falling. Same with Bolivia. So I may need... to set up some hotspots here. I need to defend some of my step my territory. Dumbes. And then this road, which goes to Suyana and Piura. Alright, let's go ahead and add a defensive hotspot there. And another one in Piura. We're gonna have an election. The ruling party is at tw oh no. Oh. We've got the IOF too. Okay, that's fine. We need... Oh, we're going to lose. This is our ruling party. The Green Party is ahead. Republican Party is even more ahead. Oh, dear. That's fine. That's fine. Where else do we want a hot spot? Puno, maybe? This electro power has got to be faster, guys. Come on now. Is this going to help me? Yeah, it's going to help me with the cultural rating. Okay, so social assistance and social spending is going to have to go up with the cabinet minister here. I've never played around with any of these. I'm letting my uh, minister deal with this stuff, but maybe I should be paying attention. I don't know. I'll let him do it. Still going down. Not great. So less than 70 days to the election. We're still holding steady at 26.6. .6. This is not going to be good. But uh, we, I'm building some more stuff here. We need, uh, We need to beef up a little bit. Okay, so they're losing a little bit of ground, but we're not gaining any ground. We're going to have to have a coup.
Yeah. Well, the military rating's up, but the domestic approval rating is dropping. Okay, a little bit of good news. We're going up slightly here to eating into their uh, into their numbers, especially the others. Well, not especially, but the Rubble Up Party, actually, I've eaten into quite a bit. I'm probably still not going to win it. Domestic approval rating is going up. Just a smidge. Of course, now the military doesn't like us. All right. Kind of holding on to my butt here. 28 days. 24 days left and I'm at 27%. This isn't going to work. It's not going to happen. Maybe we need to tax you guys a little bit less. See if that does anything. We probably need to do some more social assistance. I don't know if that's going to help. He's going to probably tweak it afterwards anyway. All right, Germany, I'm, I don't want to deal with you right now. Wow, we lost some ground. Yeah, it's going to not be a democracy for much longer. All right, I have lost the election. Seize control of your military. Um, do we want to change? Yeah, let's dictatorship. All right, we've been forced to use our military to maintain a hold on the leadership of a region. That should give you a little more economic leeway and social policies, but you must be careful with your military approval rating now. Oh, we've become evil. All right. All right. So it goes. That means we now need to do a fair amount of military stuff. We're going to do less social spending. Uh, let's see. I'm going to actually decrease social spending. Keep the domestic approval on there, but meh. All right. Now the military guy. We're going to increase readiness. Military growth. And I think, I think that'll do for now. Yeah, hopefully that'll help. I don't know. We'll see. I've never been a dictator before. Okay, yeah, we do need to stockpile uh, military commodities now. That means we need to start producing more. Oh, it looks like the electric power... Oh, it's only 40%. 48%. Oh, well. Yeah. This... Yeah, we really need that stuff. Real bad. And the Netherlands was doing a cyber attack. Oh, that's right. We're a dictator now. Um, okay. Uh... Oh, am I gonna go to war with the world? I think that might happen. Um... Alright, well, let's... Let's... Let's spy on you, you bastards. Uh, uh, espionage? We're gonna put him over and put him in Gouda. Alright. 
Wait, I didn't do... Oh, there it is. Oh, there they go. Oh, it only does one at a time. That's right. Utrecht, Gouda. And then we want to do a... Do we want to do a cyber attack? Yeah, let's do cyber attack. Ha ha. And we got another research breakthrough. All right. Digital social services is now up. Um... So now, now that we're, now that we're a dictatorship, we're gonna have to do some war shit. Right? That's, that's what dictators do, I guess. So, let's go ahead and build some stuff here, some, uh, research some things. Um... Well, you know, now that I'm looking at it, ooh, military GPS? Missile accuracy? Ooh, okay. Orbital docking. Synthetic rubber would be nice. Um, you know what? Maybe I should prioritize these guys. Clean coal, which is not a thing, but okay. Let's do upgraded coal generation and upgraded petrol generation. There we go. I'm pretty sure we need those. Yeah, that... And, well, we actually don't need coal, but we can sell coal, so that'll be handy. Alright, so one thing I'm definitely going to need to do, I mean, this is going to take so long to get the hydropower. I'm actually going to go ahead and, uh, I'm making so much coal. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make some coal plants that take less time to build and, uh, but do have a pretty decent power output. So let's go ahead and build some coal plants. Uh, where do I want to put them? Put one there. One there. Wanukom, why not? Sure. They're gonna hate me, but that's okay. I'm a military dictator now. Yeah, these will run up a lot faster. That takes 240 days, these take 95. Oh, what do we get? Digital social services, okay. So now the coal generation and petrol generation are coming. Oh yeah, good, good, good thing I picked that. Uh, clean coal technology? Clean coal power plants, I mean, sure. All right, well, maybe some uh, basic science or some warfare. Yeah, let's do some warfare here. Okay, let's see. What do we got? Chemical warfare should... No, I'm not going to be evil evil. Just a little bit evil. Military vessels from 1957. Well, shit. I feel dumb now. I'm real old. It's going to take 3.8 3 years. Oh, between 2.3 and 3.8 years. Uh, okay. All right. Well... We're a military dictator using technology no newer than 1956. How are we doing with them, though? 100%. All right. We need to stockpile more military stuff. We're only making 21. Uh, we need to make more. Yeah. And let's make those... Make a bunch of them there. Ah, okay, one of our spies from the Netherlands escaped. Okay, so this has been exciting. We've uh, changed our uh, political system to dictatorship. We started, we switched over to military production. And uh, it's, a, it's a lot to do in the first uh, 30 minutes of this playthrough. Uh, and hopefully the pauses and the, and the cuts weren't super distracting. But uh, yeah, we're going to move on from here. Like I said, I don't know exactly how often I'm going to be playing this. Um, but I will try to keep it up at least 
you know, one video a month on this. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I do really like this game. I'm just not very good at it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.